Holy shit, am I excited. I don't know about you guys, but as soon as I saw that truck that Tesla just unveiled, I just knew. I knew I had to do this. So I'm going to show you how to model it in Blender. It, it lends itself very well to just a 3D program. So yeah, we're just going to start off here. All right, so just, just go ahead and take the default box, go into edit mode, just, just cut in the middle, drag it out, stretch it out on the Y axis. All right, another one right below that, stretch that out on the Y axis as well, get it about even with the front. All right, we're pretty much done here, but we're gonna add a few more details. Um, drag that forward, there you go. And then, uh, we're gonna add some wheels, so to scale those down. Um, cylinders are pretty good for wheels, so you can just make them flat and rotate them 90 degrees on the y-axis and then just line them up. At this point, now we're just gonna put, once we're happy with this wheel, we're just gonna copy it and then make four of them. My God, this thing just, it's so dominating looking. It's crazy. It's like, it's one of the, the best looking trucks I've ever seen in my life. I have already pre-ordered it. I don't know about you guys, but I just can't wait to get it. All right, so once you get all the wheels, just line them up. And you basically, I mean, we have it here, but you know, it's it's not quite complete. We need a few more details. This thing has unbreakable windows, so um, go ahead and do those cuts I just did, and then just select those, that face basically, and just okay, extrude it in. I right, just put a hole in it. Just put a hole right in that first window, and you know, just, that's unbreakable, so don't worry about it. Um, and then select the back window, and then. Go ahead and put a hole in that one too. And just, just drag it and twist it around a little bit. All right. And for more realism, we're gonna add a ball into the window. It's a metallic ball right in there. All right. <laughs> and I think we're done.